Good morning, welcome back to Breakfast Television. Well, the Toronto Blue Jays winter tour recently stopped here in Winnipeg. Mm -hmm. And after signing autographs and meeting fans and joining us here on BT, some major leaguers made one more stop at a lucky Winnipeg school. As BT's Sean Gregg shows us, their mission was not only to promote the sport, but to share secrets to success with the students. A sea of blue toques worn by students filled the gym at a Cole Van Welligan where they anxiously waited to be greeted by some of baseball's biggest stars. It was really an experience because I haven't experienced something like that un otherwise than being at uh, a baseball game. The Toronto Blue Jays ended their two-day stay in Winnipeg making an appearance at the school as part of their nationwide Canadian winter tour to educate children about healthy eating, staying active and how to reach for the stars. Toronto Blue Jay Jose Bautista says it's a chance to inspire. I speak from the heart when I talk to these kids and I'll just speak from my experiences. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll tell them what I feel like they need to know at their young age in order to become and successful and, and hopefully uh, the message goes a long way. And the message has already begun to sink in. I always try to play, stay healthy. Sometimes I you know, don't like to eat all my vegetables and things like that, but for sure I know that if you want to be big stars like them and play professional sports, that's what you need to do. Every month at a Cole Van Welligem, a character trait is chosen for students to focus on, and this month it was initiative. Principal Brad Burns says when they heard the Blue Jays were coming to their school, it was a perfect trait the players could relate to when talking to students. Nothing is more powerful than hearing a successful person talk about what role a particular character trait played in their life. For Toronto Blue Jay Aaron Loop, this experience encouraging kids to work hard recalled the effort it took to get to this point. I remember being in the, in the yard as a little kid, always doing playing baseball or something, whether it be with a ball with, the, with all your friends or being, being in the backyard throwing with my dad and, or hitting in a baseball cage or something. Just uh, hard work definitely goes a long way. Like you said, you don't, you don't get here by overnight. The Winnipeg leg of the Toronto Blue Jays Cross Canada Winter Tour wraps up here at Van Welligem Elementary. The tour continues in Saskatoon. For Breakfast Television, I'm Sean Grack. Uh, Saskatoon, you're in for a heck of a good time. Those guys were absolutely wonderful, uh, not awesome. only with us, but with the students as well. Yeah, they took so much time out of their day to come here and chat with you for a while, which was so great. Talk about the season, talk about just being that icon to all these kids and what it means to them, and then to go visit them and sit in the crowd. How cute was that shot of Brett Cecil sitting with all the kids? <laughs> now, do you have, you have a favorite already, right? You're a Loop oh, fan yeah. now, are you? Oh, I didn't know Aaron Loop before. Now I do. He is cute. What position does he play? <laughs> I I think he pitches. Hey! Yeah! I'm to him. Great. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, for more on the Jays, you can check out breakfasttelevision.ca. Got a link to uh, not only to their site, but on that site you'll find a bunch of the video that they took while they were in town. So you may, see, if you were at Polo Park, you may see yourself on that. It's and you may see this face too. You made oh, the I cut. Was also there. I was also hey. there, yes, smiling nicely. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> breakfasttelevision.ca for all those links and all that information. Let's check on weather conditions. Let's say good morning to Jenna Khan.